The Violet Bulawayo from Zimbabwe has won the inaugural Etisa Prize for Literature. Now let's see what went down that day. A black carpet welcome for guests at the venue of the inaugural Etisalat Prize for Literature. Well, I mean, I've been part of the process for almost a year now. Um, so what we're expecting is to see a good winner. Inside the hall, everyone is chatting and having fun over cocktail. Whenever the literary world is being celebrated, it always pulls a gathering of creative minds, and this event, organized by Etisalat Nigeria, was no different. It's the maiden edition of the Etisalat Prize for Literature, assembling great minds from all over Africa under one roof, the Federal Palace Hotel in Victoria Island, Lagos. To set the ball rolling is the acting chief executive officer of Etisalat, Matthew Wilshire, who speaks on the objective of the event. We strongly support the arts. We are certain of the capacity to bridge gaps across communities, cultures, countries and continents. Through Nigerian Idols, Lagos Photo Festival, Africa's Next Top Model and other events, we continually display African arts and culture, building lifelong relationships, improving lives and businesses. By, by establishing the first Pan-African Prize for debut authors of published fiction, not only did we aim to discover, encourage and reward gifted new talent and writers, but also to promote the burgeoning publishing industry in Africa. Before announcing the winner in the flash fiction competition category, the band rendered good music for the listening pleasure of everyone here. Stepping up to the podium is one of Ghana's greatest literary minds, Ama Addo. She is here to announce the winner in the flash fiction category. Each of the top 20 writers for the Tissolat Flash Fiction Prize has succeeded in doing this in 300 words. Please think about it. 300 words to tell a whole story. From over a thousand entries, it is my distinct honor to present the 20 finalists for the Tissalat Prize for Literature, Flash Fiction Category. Iola by Olubenga Okumbawale. That is just funny by Eric Arthur. Neverland by Uche Okumbo. Silent Screams by Jeremiah Luwabamishi, Seren. The inaugural winner is Uche Okonko, Netherlands. Uche, she's a girl. Thank you, 
And before the big announcement, there's special recognition for some great African writers. The whole then came alive when Yusun Do, arguably Senegal's biggest music export, mounts the stage and renders some of his hit songs. And the moment came to announce the winner. We are deeply privileged present the 2013 Etisalat Prize for Literature. Bomboa by Yewande Omotoshua. Finding Salve by Karen Jennings. We Need New Names by No Violet Lowayo. Our award, very special award. We are all aware of the shortage of literary prizes on the continent, even as African writers have always and consistently produced compelling literature. So I, I think it's very significant and important that we have our own prize to speak to the work that is being produced. fantastic I'm really proud um, and uh, it's amazing after the long list we had which was quite a challenging long list with all the attempts at uh, great things that these novelists have attempted that we finally have a winner. Etisalat Nigeria said it's proud to use its maiden Pan-African Prize for Literature to recognize and celebrate the amazing works done by these unique individuals.